hi today we are going to discuss about Barth's law it's an experimental gas law it states the relation between pressure and volume mathematically it can be written as uh, pressure is inversely proportional to volume uh, if consider a system with a pressure uh, p1 and v1 then apply a uh, pressure on the system and the volume of the system will decrease it means when the volume increases the pressure of the system is less vice versa and it can be useful for uh, relating to the pressure and volume and it can be graphically represented like this volume can be taken as x-axis and pressure is taken as y-axis when volume decreases the pressure of the system goes up and mathematically that is uh, pressure is proportional to 1 over V and it also can be written as pressure and volume that is equal to the constant p is equal to constant and one or more one graphical representation can be useful to describe the relation and where uh, v is taken as x axis and the inverse pressure that is taken as y axis which gives a linear graph it is very useful for uh, comparing the two systems uh, take one system one system two and remember p is equal to k constant and system 1 have P1, V1 as the pressure and volume and system 2 has P2, V2 as the pressure and volume. We can compare these two as P1, V1 is equal to P2, V2. Okay, let's look at an example. And if a system contains 1.5 bar and the gas molecule occupies 2 litre volume of the container, if another system have 2 bar pressure, how much volume will occupy the similar gas molecule? And uh, remember P1, V1 is equal to P2, V2 and system 1 have the pressure 1.5 bar and volume 2 liter and system 2 have 2 bar pressure and we have to find out the volume by mathematically we can get 1.5 liter. Okay, thank you. Please watch my videos and subscribe. Thank you.